You may have known that this episode is set in the 1960s. But here are 10 things you may not have known about WandaVision, don't touch the dial. The stage names used by Vision and Wanda in their magic show are Illusion and Glamour. Illusion and Glamour were the stage names used by the stage magician couple Ilya and Glynis Zarkov, who were neighbors of Wanda and Vision in the comic Vision and the Scarlet Witch. The animated title sequence contains references to Wanda and Vision's comic and movie history. The title sequence starts with six stars twinkling in a circle, referring to the Infinity Stones that gave Wanda and the Vision their powers in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. When the Vision gets ready for work, the helmet of the Grim Reaper, a comic book enemy to the Vision and Scarlet Witch, can be spotted on the bedroom floor, alongside some bones. When Wanda is shopping, there is an advertisement for Bova Milk. In the comics, Bova was a sentient cow who raised Wanda and her brother Pietro in their childhood. Another advertisement is for Auntie A's cat litter. This refers to Agatha Harkness and her cat Ebony, who was an ally to Wanda in the comics. The title of Auntie Agatha comes from the comic New Avengers 26, January 2007. The house Wanda and Vision are in is the same house used for National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation. The house next door was the Murtaugh House in Lethal Weapon. Both houses are on the Warner Brothers Ranch, which is where the Bewitched House is also located. The opening and interior design for this episode are based on Bewitched. All exteriors for this episode were filmed at the ranch. The interior set is designed similar to the house in Bewitched, 1964. In the cabinet Wanda and Vision use for their magic trick, there is a shape identical to one of the Infinity Stones, likely the Mind Stone. The Strucker watch is set at 242. The Avengers comic, issue number 242, December 1983, had the Vision appear with a newly repaired body. Big Red Gum, that gums up Vision in this episode, is another item in the series incorporating the color red. The toy red helicopter, Dottie's Red Blood, and the red light on the Stark brand toaster from the first episode advertisement. Big Red Gum is a bit of an anachronism as the product first appeared on the market in 1975 in the USA and later in other countries. If this pocket reality is based on Wanda's concept of an ideal life from watching TV show reruns in her youth, then Big Red Gum might also be a fondly remembered USA product from her childhood. This episode is based on the sitcom Bewitched. The set of Wanda and Vision's home is nearly identical to the Stevens' home from Bewitched, but it is mirrored with their staircase to the right rather than the left side like the Stevens, their living room to the left instead of the right. The toy helicopter that Wanda finds in a bush is consistent with the 50s and 60s as it resembles a Sikorsky H-19, which first entered military service in 1950 and became known for its use during the Korean War. Westview could be a reference to Kevin Feige's hometown of Westfield, New Jersey, which is similar to the type of suburban town depicted in this episode. So what did you think of this video? Did you know any of these cool facts? Let us know in the comments section below what you would like to see next. Thanks for hanging out with us here at Movie Mistakes, and we'll see you next time. Wanda. Who's doing the sea, Wanda?